Oh, thank goodness. Were you guys not able to, were you commenting earlier and I wasn't able to see it? Is that what was happening? Oh, that was terrible. Hey, that gave me anxiety. It gave me anxiety. Hey, Jacqueline. Hey, Teresa. Hey, Paula. I was like, what is happening? That was crazy. You couldn't hear me either? You couldn't hear me? Oh, my gosh. That was crazy. I don't know that that's ever happened to me. I've seen it happen to other people, but I don't know if it's ever happened to me. You can hear me. I was just posting away on the other video. I couldn't see any comments. I saw all these people jumping on and I saw no comments. So now I lost all my people. It's so sad. So sad. All that sharing gone to waste. Well, maybe they'll come back. <laughs> well, hopefully they'll come back. Oh, I hate that. Maybe they'll see the video and it was only on for a few minutes. So they'll watch it and they'll see that um, we were having technical difficulties. Maybe they'll be able to come back and find us again. I hope that's straight. I feel like it's not. I feel like it's not straight. I best do it side to side. Then we can just lay it down. <clears throat> oh, that was so crazy. So listen, we got an email today from Chocotour and they're talking about shipping for the holidays. If you are looking to purchase anything, my suggestion to you is to purchase it before December 1st, especially if you want it for Christmas. And so I'm also going to do those Christmas boxes. And I, I thought about like, you know, coming up with certain things in the Christmas box. But this is what I thought would be even better. You tell me what you want in your Christmas box. Like if it's a gift for someone, you tell me how much you want to spend and what you, or what you want in your box specifically. Or, um... How you want to do that. I'm still going to do that wish list thing. I need to do that this week. It's been crazy since I got asked to do this thing. I've been trying. David and I have been trying to get like the frames. Look at the frames he made me. He made me some really pretty frames. Look at that. How pretty is that? He made a bunch of them. He made some. I, I, we painted them all different colors and stained them and stuff. So they're really pretty. So we've been working on that. Getting that all set up. Getting his workshop set up so he can help me. And so I will get that Google wish list done, I promise. And um, also, Rennie's having trouble getting in. Let me see if I can tag her. I'm telling you, there's something crazy going on with um, Facebook tonight. It's not even letting me tag. It's like jumping all over the place. <clears throat> social media that does not want you to be social. 
I don't understand. <clears throat> I don't understand. I just want to be social. I just want to craft. It's not even letting me tag. Oh, Lord. Can somebody tag her? Do the at sign and then her name if you're friends with her on Facebook. And then when her name pops up, click on it and it will tag her. <clears throat> because it's not letting me do that. Hold on. Hold the phone. Let me try. Let me try again. I might have been on the wrong video. I'm not going to lie. I was on the wrong video. Okay, ready? Are you here? Ah, she's here. Okay. Problem solved. All right, so I'm going to do Cinnamon Nutcracker. Um, I don't know what colors I'm going to do on this. It's silver on the back, so I feel like black and oh lord my red is terrible what am my poppy poppy's red poppy looks good maybe i'll use the poppy and the black that would be cool a eh? yeah maybe that's what's gonna happen all right, I'm glad Rennie's here. Everything's complete. We lost all the people. We had so many people watching. I don't even remember where I shared it to. That's terrible. <clears throat> That's just awful. Leave that right there. Is that in y'all's way? Okay. All right, so please share again. Share this video if you would. I guess I should share it onto my page. I'm back in the group again. And then let everybody know that, you know, we had a little mishap. Let's see. All right. See if that works. See if we get some people to watch. I don't know. That was terrible. Terrible, I tell you. All right, so I'm going to do this cinnamon nut cracker sign. It's so stinking cute, right? So I'm going to do sun in and nut in black and then do of a nutcracker in red. I think that's what I'm going to do. Let's see how that works. Just swipe this on. Take that excess off. Bring it down here to nut. I think this will be really cute. Take that excess off. Make sure we don't have any lines. Super cute. And let's do of a in this poppy color because my red is terrible. Let's see how the poppy looks. Let's just do this whole thing. It'll just be a lighter red, I think, because it's just like more of a Poppy red. So cute. This is a really cute piece. Dude and brown nuts are brown. Oh, that's really stinking cute. That's really stinking cute. See how I um, make a mess everywhere I go? I paint all over me all day today. All right, that's super cute. I love it. 
Let me just close these up so I don't stick my arm in it again. Yeah, that poppy did really well. That just bent me, might be my summer, my uh, Christmas color. Son of a Nutcracker. I love that. That's really cute. Let me blow dry that real quick so I don't bump it. Super cute. All right. That was project number one. How easy was that? Son of a nutcracker. Look how nice and crisp and clean those lines are. Because friends, that is a silk screen I am using. That is not a stencil. I'll get something in my eye. Ooh. Something in the eye. Put that right there to dry. The next one I'm going to do for that market that I'm going to is this vintage piece that they, I think, yeah, market, it's not a market, I mean the shop at the tree farm because I think that like these vintage pieces people will just love, right? They'll just love these pieces. And this fits. No, he didn't make that frame. That was one I had bought. He made me a, a bunch of frames, though. And he did not make this one that I'm using right now, either. These are ones that I had bought. Okay. I didn't wax this, but it's very, very... It's very um, soft. Should be okay. See if we can get this in here. Hoping that this whole thing will fit. I love this transfer. It just screams like vintage Christmas. Make sure we have no bubbles in this. We need more of that silver background. What do you mean, the metal? Metal's pretty. The thing with that galvanized like steel and stuff like that is um, you can't change your design out. Once it's on there, it will it will leave ghosting. So I don't I don't buy too many metal pieces because I like to change them out unless I'm doing it for like you know custom piece or I'm selling it. All right, this looks pretty good. Now that I took you know painstaking time to do that and then I didn't even measure, but you know what? That's pretty close. Okay, pretty close to soon. It looks, wow, this is going to look so pretty on this frame. I'm super excited about this. Okay, so we are going to do, oh wait, you know what? Before I do that, hold the phone. Hold, hold your bananas. Hold on one second. Let me clean this transfer real quick like. So, I can put it back on its back of the sheet. Get this all cleaned up, put it back, so I can use it again and again and again. Real quick, just clean it off. Hi, Marsha. All right. back 
on. Get that paste off the front. Perfect. And that one is good to go. All right. So we'll do this one now. So I did this on a, on a, oh, I did this on a pillowcase last time. So I know I need green for the tree. I think I'm going to do the truck. What color should I do the truck in, folks? What color do you want me to do the truck in? I'm going to leave it up to y'all. I cannot believe I lost like 20 people when that video didn't work. Oh, that's so sad. What color do you want me to do the truck in? I'm going to do the truck. I'm going to do this green. I'm going to do this, I think. Maybe I'll do this in, um, oh, I'll do this in the shimmer red. Shimmer. That's shimmer red because it's kind of like a darker red. That would be really pretty. I'll do this in the shimmer red. And then what color do, do you want the truck? Should I do the truck in black? I'm doing this in shimmer red, so I'm, I don't want to do the truck in red. So, blue. Hmm. I only have that midnight blue, and that's just, doesn't look very Christmassy. Um, let's see. What color could that truck be? Could be gray. It could be... Oh, Lord have mercy. I don't even know. Hold on. I got to go under the table because I don't even know what just fell. A paste fell. And it'll probably be what I'll be looking for. I'll be right back. Talk amongst yourselves. I thought it was a paste, but it wasn't. Okay, it was my little cup thing. Yeah, it's that little cup. Okay, it's all good. That was a hot mess. Oh Lord. Um, okay, back to the truck. Brown. Hmm. Brown truck with red and green. Hmm. If I did this, I was thinking about outlining this in black. These little swirlies, doing those in black. So, I don't know. Silver shimmer. Do you think that would show up? I don't know if that would show up. Oh, this is so hard. Gold shimmer. Well, if I did the truck in brown, with the black trim, this is the hardest part, folks. It's figuring out what color we're going to do. But. I did the truck in gray last time and I didn't really love it. So, and then brown with the green, with the black trim. I don't know. So if I just, do, if I don't use the shimmer red,
Okay, what if I did this? What if I did, oh, Christmas tree farm. What if I did it in gold, the words, and then I did the green tree, with the green and gold, and then I could do the truck. I don't love that color combination. Now, I want to do a oh, Christmas tree farm in red. I might just have to do the truck in black. I don't know. Anybody else got any ideas? Words gold, black truck. Hmm. Words gold, black truck. And then I gotta do this. I could do this in red shimmer. That could work. Alright. This is a one and done because if I don't like it, I can't change it. Because it's not on a chalkboard. That's why I'm so perplexed. Black truck. I think the truck would look good in black. I can't do that. This is perplexing. All right, this is what I'm going to do. I think I'm just going to do the red shimmer for this. the words. I'm going to do a black truck, green tree, and I'm going to outline all this in black too. Let's just go with that. So we're going to need black, green, because I think that, I think that that would look the best. We'll just see. We'll just see how this goes. I'm going to unplug this. Hold on. I'm a hot mess tonight. Usually I'd just go for it, you know, and then say, well, I'll put it up in my house, but these are pieces I'm going to sell for sure. So I want to make sure that I get it right. Okay. You know, that other people would like it. Now let's do the black first. Let's do the trim in black. Here's what I did last time because it's stained. Yeah, it's staying to transfer. I totally did this in black last time. Oh, no. I totally messed up that letter. Concentrating, y'all. Concentrating. Let's see if I messed up that letter. I did not. Perfect. Did not mess up that letter. That is perfect. Put that back down. Make sure that's all down. Oh, I just messed up that letter now. Now I did. What a dork. Hold on. Let's see if I can get that off of there because it did not wax this. No. Just made it worse. I don't know why I'm such a goofball sometimes. Okay, not so bad. Let me blow dry it so it's nice and dry. Clean that off. Put that 
down. Make sure that transfers back down. So I don't get any bleeding. It is hot in here. Okay. Alright. We should be okay. Let's do some shimmer red on this part. Taking my time with it. So I don't bump into anything like I just did earlier. Because I don't want to do that. I'm putting up my first tree tomorrow. It's going to be uh, in our boutique room. That's the plan anyway. So my house is going to start looking like Christmas and it's not even Thanksgiving. Gotta love it. Trying to be real careful because I don't want to get on those lines. This one's going to be super cute too. So I had ordered two more sets of those Christmas trees, the wooden Christmas trees. I don't know what I'm going to do on them. I'm going to do a set and bring them to the shop, but um, I don't know what I'm going to do on them. Form. The uh, shimmer paste doesn't seem to dry as fast, so I feel like I can get away with doing form and then doing that trim right there and then lip peeling it up. I feel like I'll be okay. Try to get in all those little, get all that silk screen covered. I'm gonna take that excess up. Okay, perfect. That was perfect. Let's go back with this treacherous black. Black. This black is a killer. Get it in there. Probably should have made it a little thinner. Stir that up a little bit. A little bit thinner. So I want to bump into my tree right there. Y'all see me? I always have a habit of hanging out of the video. I'm so sorry. Get this. Get this. Let's do this up here. I shouldn't have done that far down. I got carried away. Do this in here. Oops, 
right here. It's got so many of these little swirlies. So many little swirlies. So I'm gonna do these swirlies here and then I'm gonna lift it up and hope I didn't let it dry too far. One. Just got to get in all those little silk screens. Make sure you don't miss any. Let's take a um, little squeegee and take off that excess. Okay, let's peel that back. Oh, I didn't get it real good in here. Let me get it in here. Not going through real real dark I don't know why this happened to me last night didn't it where it wouldn't go through real dark on some of it I just went over part of my tree I don't understand that let's see what's happening could be on the board it's probably something on the board because the other parts came through okay it's the wood let's fill that up okay put that back down Yeah, it's just the wood, I think. Okay, so what did I say I was gonna do the truck in? Black, hmm, again with the black. Hold on, let me rinse this off. Let me rinse this off. I'm gonna do that tree first. I might need that for the tree. All right. Let's see. I'll look up in a second. Hello, Deborah from Maine. So glad to have you join us. What else we got? Um, yeah, I like the words in the red shimmer too. I'm almost wondering if I let that dry and then I go back and do those lines again, if it would uh, pick it up better. It's gotta be something in the wood, like a finish on the wood or something. Oh, I just drove black into it, that's awesome. I sure did. The black on my Christmas tree. 
<clears throat> All right, let's do, let's peel it up. See, part of the tree didn't take either. It's got to be this wood. I wonder if I would have waxed it. I'm not, I, don't, I don't think I waxed it. I didn't wax it. I wonder if I would have waxed it. I've done these pieces, pieces on this before, and it didn't do that. So that's kind of weird. So... I'm guessing I should just do this truck in black. Yeah. I'm going to do the truck in brown. Let's try the truck in brown. Give it another color. Like, you know, it's earthy. Okay. Let's try the truck in brown. The wheels would be in brown then. Hmm. I don't know how that would look. And they're connected. I better do it in black. Because that'll look kind of weird, I think. <clears throat> I'm so indecisive. I'm just so indecisive. I'm just hoping. I don't want to do that windshield. I'm just hoping that this truck doesn't come out faint like some of that other stuff did. I mean, if I really don't like this, or it, it's got mistakes on it or something, I can just use it. Just use it in my house. And I'll just know that when you buy these kinds of boards, you gotta be careful. to go on on this window too I know last time I did it with the window and I didn't like it I didn't like the window the same color We're right over the tree. I'm just going to leave the windows like that. I wonder what that's going to look like. Hold on. Yeah, see, it did it to the truck, too. Well, that's a shame. It's kind of like, um, I don't know. It's kind of like vintagey. See what it did? I don't know, I kind of like it. Kind of looks worn. It looks distressed. It really does. So I feel like if you buy these boards at, you know, your favorite craft store, you're going to have to wax them. 
And I don't even know if that's going to work. It's just got a real weird finish on it, I guess. But I like it. It's kind of vintagey looking. It really does. It's different. I wish the whole thing would have come out like that. Where it wasn't dark in some spots and it was faded in the others. Because if the whole thing was like that, it would have looked like washed out. It would have looked really cool. But, I mean, it still looks good. I like it. Okay. Take that one. Let me wash this. So this that's going to be a big burger to wash. So I'll just wait on that. Let's do... Where'd I put it? I'm just going to do one on here. I don't know what I was going to do. No, I was going to do this one. I think I'm just going to put this on here and make this into a hanger. This is just a piece of wood. I know, it kind of does look like vintage, doesn't it? Like antiqued. It's crazy how that turned out. So let me go ahead and wax this. I mean, if it wasn't for that, that piece came out really good. I love that. I'm gonna put that on a shirt. I'm gonna do that on a shirt. Okay, I'm just putting a little bit of uh, Minwax Paste Finishing Wax in a natural color. Um, I painted this, so this is like a uh, chalk paint on here. So I just wanted to make sure that there was no like wood fragments or anything like that. And I just buffed it in, makes it really smooth and shiny, it's really pretty. You need to have a variety for people to say, yes, yes, sure do, sure do. Just going to put this on here. I'm going to drop it a little lower because I'm going to put a hanger on it. Let's see if we got that somewhat close. That's about an inch. Ooh. That's off a little bit. There it is. Make sure that's stuck really good. Um, I think I'm just going to do this in, I wonder how the red shimmer would show up on here, or gold, I'm assuming gold, gold would be pretty. Let me close these up real quick. Let's close these up real quick like. I don't drop anything in them or stick my fingers in them or, you know, any of that good stuff. All right. Let's do gold. That gold is so thin. It's crazy how thin that is. It's like fluffy liquid gold. It's crazy. Okay, so if I did that in gold, then I did the bottom in... I'm just do the whole thing in gold. That'll be pretty. I'll just do the whole thing in gold. Got little stars over there though. I'm not sure about the stars. This is like liquid. I'm 
This is gonna be so pretty. Could have done it in silver too. The gold is really pretty. So should I do the bottom in gold? What am I doing? Um, if I did the bottom in, I, mean, I could do it in white, but that'd be like too stark, I think. I'll just do the whole thing in gold. That'd be pretty. Super pretty. Super pretty. All right, put all that back in my jar so I can reuse that. Let's peel it up. Oh, that's really pretty. And it's got built-in distressing in it, so it's really cool. I love that. Okay. That's really pretty. I love that. So I will do a pretty bow for that. That's really cool. So I'll do a pretty bow for that and I'll hang, do a pretty hanger and it'll be, it'll be so pretty. This will be pretty in a wreath too. It'll be real pretty in a wreath. All right, ladies, I think that is all I have, but look, I did, I bought two sets of the Christmas trees. Super excited. I got another set of ornaments. So I'm super excited about that. So that is all I had for you tonight. Um, check back with me in this weekend. Make sure you're liking and following my page and this video. Press on the screen when the bell comes up. Hit follow or subscribe so you will get notified when I go live. Thank you for sticking with me if you came back for the second part because we had no comments in the first video. I appreciate you all very much. And... Um, I look forward to seeing you again on my next live. You Look, I made the shirt. See the shirt? I forgot to show you that. I made the shirt. Once, one, what does it say? It says one child, one star, one night. I thought I got ink on, uh, chalk on it. So we have this transfer as well. If you like anything you see on my lives, you can do this yourself. Just go to my website that's pinned in the bottom, chalkwithlisa.com. You can get all of your supplies there. If you have any questions, please message me or comment under this video. And I'd be happy to answer your questions and help you get started. If you're interested in doing what I do and becoming a designer, just shoot me a message and um, I can help you get signed up and get started. And we also have Club Couture. It's a monthly subscription, and we have chalk boxes. So um, get your orders in early, ladies, because if you have Christmas in mind, um, I am going to do those Christmas boxes, and I'll put those up in a couple of days. Because I bought really pretty boxes, so I have to use them. bought a lot of them, so I have to use them. So um, if you're looking for a great Christmas gift for someone, this is a great craft for them to do. They'll enjoy it. They'll love it. They'll be proud of what they make. And um, you'll be like the best gift giver ever. All right, ladies, thanks. Have a blessed night.